If, after activating the clean printhead routine two times in a row, along with manufacturer's suggested printer cleaning procedures, blank pages are observed or output print quality is extremely poor, for example, you observe several missing colors in the print quality diagnostic report where otherwise all colors should normally be present with no visible streaking, then the printhead may have partially dried out and a hot water flush may be necessary to help recover the ink system. Note, this procedure should be considered a last ditch effort just prior to printhead replacement and assumes that there is an adequate amount of ink available for ink system recovery. For example, at least 30% of ink is available within each ink cartridge. This procedure is only applicable to HP printers that feature a removable printhead assembly and should only be attempted after all other recovery suggestions from HP have been exhausted. To begin, check your printer documentation to see if you are able to remove the printhead from the printer. Remove all ink cartridges from the printer. Remove the printhead. In most cases, you will need to pull up on the lever at the right side of carriage assembly to unlock the printhead. Lift printhead straight up to remove. Over a sink, run warm tap water directly into the four or five ink ports for approximately two minutes. This will effectively saturate the foam ports and blow ink out and through the nozzle plate bottom. Using a lint-free towel, remove water from the rear and bottom electrical contacts. Ensure printhead electrical contacts and exposed surfaces are fully dry. Install the printhead and cartridges into the printer. You may observe a replace printhead message, so you will need to cycle printer power by turning printer off and then on to clear the error. You should observe a new printhead alert message followed by an approximate four minute printer preparation countdown prompt. Note, reseeding or insertion of the printhead into the printer will consume approximately eight to 10% of the ink and effectively reprime all colors within the ink system. Activate the print quality report. This can be done from the printer's control panel or software printer driver. For example, by selecting tools, print quality report or similar. Verify all colors have recovered and no visible streaking or fade is present in the print report. If you have reached this point of the troubleshooting and all of the previous troubleshooting steps did not work or a replace printhead or ink system failure message persists, then the printhead is likely electrically damaged or at end of life and may need to be replaced. Note. Typically, the average printhead should not reach its end of life until after a minimum of eight or more complete sets of cartridges have been used in the printer. Printing frequently, perhaps once or twice a week, is one of the best ways to maintain your printer's overall printhead health. It is suggested you refill your cartridge as soon as you see the print quality begin to fade. Don't wait until the last color runs dry. Continuing to print with a cartridge that is running dry can result in air bubbles being ingested into the printhead and will ultimately lead to poor image quality. You may continue to print until print quality begins to fade. Identify the respective color by running a self-test or print quality report and then bring that respective cartridge or cartridges in for refilling. For more information on ink tank refilling, ink cartridge refill locations, or advanced printer problem resolutions and diagnostics, please visit inkjet411.com.